So the front has their logo, night vision sensors and microphones, and the camera and stuff like that, and their logo right there. Very, very sleek. back with another camera video today. The nice fine folks over at Yada. I'm pretty certain that's how it's pronounced. The Y-A-T-A, Yada. The nice fine folks at Yada sent me their new wireless IP camera. So uh, here on the front of the box, it talks about pet care, elderly care, home security, etc. This is one of those nice home security cameras where it can look up and down and left to right for you and you're even able to maneuver all that through the app from wherever you are as long as you have an internet connection so of course today we're going to take this camera we're going to unbox it and we're going to set it up and then after i've used this for about two weeks we'll come back and i'll do a uh, full review on this camera so i guess let's get into the unboxing and setup make sure you click that like button for me click subscribe indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch let's unbox this thing and set it up this camera is good for your home security, your baby care, your elderly care, your pet care, and your store surveillance. Their logo on the side. On the back, a little bit of information. You got view via phone, two-way audio, motion detection, phone alarm, PTZ control, which means that it can look left and right and up and down, cloud storage, digital zoom, auto day and night settings. And then their logo again, nothing on the top, and uh, just the barcode and stuff on the bottom. So let's slide the top off, and then let's open up the box here. Nice little foam, warranty card, wireless IP camera quick installation guide, some uh, access to operation videos and detailed user manuals, and then this guide is of course in a couple of different languages for you. Looks like we'll use the MIPC app as the uh, languages of course. Let's get out this. This is likely the power brick and maybe a mounting kit. So yes, an included USB power adapter, some screws in case you want to mount it, and then a mounting plate. So uh, you take these two screws, put through here, and then your camera would kind of turn on. I'll show you that in a moment. Micro USB cable is the power cable that's included. This is about a... Dun, dun, dun. My measurements are always based on my height. So I'm like 5'8". This goes just above my head. So I would say this is easily a six foot power cable. And then last but certainly not least, with a little extra foam in there is the actual, is the actual camera. All right. So this one has a reset button on top and a micro SD card slot on top. That is always good for uh, saving all of your clips or maybe even continuous recording depending on the app and as I mentioned here on the bottom this is uh, where this would kind of rotate in like so and then boom you could have this thing mounted upside down and move this around and you know how you'd mount a camera. So the front has their logo night vision sensors and microphones and the camera and stuff like that and their logo right there very very sleek and as I mentioned this one can look left to right up and down it can do all of it this video is not going to be the review as i mentioned before this is just going to be the unboxing and setup moment we'll get the app installed and uh, we'll go through the setup of this that should do it for the yada wireless ip camera unboxing now uh let's set this thing up we've got our camera plugged in and uh this side ready to go into the wall so let's plug this into the wall and then uh, go through the setup you can hear the click so there is two places that you can go to download the app there's either a barcode here on the side of your box, and there's also a barcode here and your user's manual. The MIPC app I happen to already have from another product. Hey, a little drip noise. Waiting for receiving the wireless config information. Oh, okay, okay. So uh, this is what the app looks like. I apparently had uninstalled it because I don't have it anymore, so we're going to reinstall it. Ooh, luckily for me, my information was saved. All right, so once you get into your app, that's what the app will look like there, MIPC. Once you get into this, you go to your top left corner over here and click Add. It'll need uh, to obtain permission before usage. Just to obtain the Wi-Fi list, so we allow that, of course, while using the app. And then there's different types of cameras, where you have a fixed camera, panoramic, dome. This is a PTZ camera, so we'll select PTZ, and then now it's needing to use my camera while using the app. And on the bottom of our camera is our QR code. I feel like I had this issue before with the um, with this app, was it did not... Uh, 
I couldn't get the QR code. So if you run into an issue where you can't get the QR code, um, you can enter the device ID manually, which is going to be that very long ID there next to password. And yes, I see the password's admin. I will definitely change that, but you won't know it. So we'll enter that ID real quick. 1-A-F-E-G-R-S-C. That looks to be correct and it already knows that password is admin currently it's funny it gives an ethernet option here i don't really know how that would work but we're going to select wi-fi and enter in our wi-fi password and then now please turn on wait 30 seconds until the device emits a continuous drip sound so we've been hearing that so here continuous drip So it's connected to the router, then it's connected to the server, and there's my notification from Nest telling me that uh, this device has joined the network. It also says please adjust the speaker of the mobile phone during configuration and place it 10 centimeters next to the camera, so I'm just going to leave it like this. It that way. Configuration failed. Please make sure the Wi-Fi password you enter is correct. The device does not support 5 gigahertz. Alright, so we're going to close this. And it definitely didn't add. Um, so let's try this again. Okay, add it successfully. And there's the camera now. The current time zones don't match. But you can see, there's a, there I am. That was a little weird. So if you get a failed message, go back out. Type in the code again and see if it works. <laughs> Let's see what this says. Welcome to Smart Cloud Camera. Please change the default password and personal settings. Yeah, we'll change this. All right, gave it a new camera. Use your phone's time zone. And then we're going to call this. Um, and then uh, if you want to do cloud storage, you have that option. Um, I'm not looking to do that, of course. All right. So there's how you can zoom. We'll go through more of this, um, you know, getting an SD card installed and stuff like that. We'll go through more of that in the actual review video. So that's what it's like to set up the Atta camera. It went pretty smooth other than that weird issue where that it seemed like it didn't connect. And uh, even though it seemed like it didn't connect, it in return did connect. So I don't think that was too much of an issue. Just uh, if you come across that, try to close out, put in the device key again and see if it connects for you the second time. Because as you saw in my video, as soon as I typed it in the second time, it instantly connected. But that should do it for the Yatta wireless IP camera setup. All right, and that should do it for the unboxing and setup of this little guy. Very, very straightforward, like a lot of other security cameras. Now I am gonna throw in a micro SD card for my review video, which that review video will probably post in two weeks, I'd say, two to three weeks. I try to use them for a little bit of time, and then once I've used them for long enough and feel like I know enough about the app, I'll show you the app, and tell you my thoughts on the Yatta wireless IP camera. So that'll do it for today's video. Make sure you click that subscribe button to tune in in a couple of weeks and see the review on this. I've also got a link below down in the description if you want to pick one of these up for yourself. And that'll do it for this video. Click that like button for me. Click subscribe. Indulge in your life at indulgeclothing.com for the merch. And I'll see you all next time. Deuces.